Hey guys, welcome back to another YouTube video. Today I'm going to be showing you the battle pass for this season. Mainly just the skins. Here's an emote. Guilty of sweating. There's this cube. But this is Renzo the Destroyer. Pretty cool. He has alternate styles. Here's his glider. Also pretty cool, but not as cool. But here's his alternate style for the battle pass. And then we got Imani. Who I kind of don't like all that much. I don't like the way her face looks. I'm not going to lie. Like, I just don't like her, like, cool style, but I wish it wasn't an anime skin, you know? That's the only reason I kind of don't like it, but that's, that's cool, Future Faimani. We got Thunder, which is the awesomest skin in this battle pass. And then his Midnight Snack Thunder. It's pretty awesome, too. Now you got Mystica, which is bald, but I think she's just Amani. I think she's Amani. The similarities are the same. They're pretty close. But this this version of her is pretty cool. It's like the Nizumi skin. The alternate stars are cooler. Who's that? Anyway, level 54. You could probably unlock this guy. But I think th this version of him is a lot cooler. And then, th and then we finally get this score. Which, her alternate style is pretty awesome as well. I like her alternate style more. And last lastly, I think, well, not lastly, because there's one more skin. We have River Empress Mizuki. And then her alternate style, which is... Oh, that's an emote. It's a built-in emote. But that's the last thing. <gasps> oh, yeah, that's her alternate style. There we go. But let's look at the bonus rewards. That background is pretty awesome. We used the alternate style for Mystica, which is also pretty cool. I like this version of her better. Then we got the alternate style for... Uh, uh, I forgot his name already. This version of him looks cool. Then we got Magmatic Mizuki. And then we don't know what happens from here on out. But in 20 days, we'll discover. <gasps> oh, okay. In case you didn't know, uh, this was actually, I knew it would be a banner icon because I talked about it to myself, I thought. And uh, if you looked, if you looked in the crypt cryptograms or whatever they're called that make images out of sound, this is actually the banner icon. This is in the video. And I think it also applies to other stuff, you know? Here's the other the version of Imani. Here's Rumbling Thunder. Ooh! I like that. This version is also pretty cool. Uh, this version of her is okay. I like the color scheme. What's this? Literally can't hear anything. Here's Aaron Yeager. Get this emote. And then the Fortnite crew skin. But I bet after these alternate styles, 
these are the coolest styles that you will figure out later. Anyways, this is all the Battle Pass skins. I'm gonna miss this box. Anyways, that's all the Battle Pass skins. Now, if you look at the map, there are... Hold on. I clearly don't have a... Oh, you can't see the map here. Anyway, there are a couple things that they have vaulted and unvaulted. Now, I do not have any pictures for the new guns, but they have brought back the pump shotgun and a better version of the slurp juice that heals health and shield at the same time. But the guns that they have unvaulted was the combat shotgun, of course. You can now get it in, at any chest, but that's what I mean by that. They brought back the Cobra DMR, the Heavy Sniper Rifle, the Dragon's Breath Sniper, the Heisted Breacher Shotgun, the Heisted Accelerant, the Heisted Blink Mag, and the Heisted Running Gun. But they also can't brought back the Shield Bubble and Heavy Bullets because the well, Snipers are back. However, this list is long. The guns they have vaulted are the AR, the Burst AR, the DMR, the Excalibur, the Aegis Excalibur, the Thunder Shotgun, the Heavy Shotgun, the Machine SMG, Rocket Launcher, Mechanical sh Shockwave Bow, Mechanical Explosive Bow, mechanic oh, Primal Stink Bow, Primal Flame Bow, Grapple Bow, Unstable Bow, which I didn't know those two bows st were still in the game. Guardian Shield, the Falcon Scout, the Big Bush Bomb, the Impulse Grenade, the Throwable Launch Pad, the Deku Smash, the All Might Supply Drop, which, thank God, the Trail Thrasher, the Motor Boat, which, by the way, if you don't know what the Trail Thrasher is, that's the name for the Dirt Bike, which could jump, and these new bikes can't jump. They took off. They took away the off-road tires, the cow catcher, the ice cream, which I forgot that was in the game, but I know it was in the game because there was an ice cream truck that spawned ice cream, and there was a guy that threw the ice cream at you. They also removed arrows, rockets, and oath-bound chests. Plus, the new. Let's go into the game. real fast and let's discover the new locations which they don't have battle lab by the way so we can't look at the locations without getting fought at shot at anymore but yeah 